Assalamu alaikum. Mr. Moderator, our distinguished guests, brothers and sisters, our friends and, and our enemies. Family, Conor McGregor, is he's down pretty bad. For those of you who've been living under a rock, he has been recently ordered to pay a woman 306k in a civil ray piston case. So over here in this article, as we can see, it says the Conor McGregor, the former USC champion and one of the biggest names in mixed martial arts fighting, has been ordered to pay more than 250,000 euros, approximately 350, 60,000 Canadian, to a woman who accused him of ray pistoning her at a hotel in Dublin in 2018. McGregor, whose civil case played out in Ireland's high court, must hand over the funds and damages to Nikita Hand, who also goes by by Nikita uh, Ni Lam Hin. I don't know. I don't know what kind of name that is. Okay, maybe Vietnamese or something. I don't know. Hand previously said McGregor brutally ray pistoned and battered her on December 9th. 2018. The assault happened after a night of partying and ha left her heavily bruised and suffering from post-traumatic stress disorder, she said. So this happened four days ago, I think it was, right? The news broke out about this. But ever since that, then the fall ha the has been pretty severe. So over here, we have Conor McGregor axed from Hitman game after being found liable in civil Ray Piston case. The Dublin trial, which lasted nearly two weeks, concluded on Friday the, the jury finding McGregor civilly liable. But the, wait, there's more. Conor McGregor's whiskey, proper 12, pulled from store shelves across the UK and Ireland as court fallout con continues. Conor McGregor lost his sexual assault civil case last week and will be forced to pay the victim 260000 The former USC 2 division champion is expected to appeal the jury's ruling, claiming the kangaroo court failed to give him a fair shake, but the damage may already be, be done. Okay, And Conor McGregor says he's going to appeal the case, as you see here. Conor McGregor regrets his infidelity, but vows to appeal the, sexual, the verdict in the sexual assault civil case. Colin McGregor has issued what he says is a final statement addressing the civil, recent civil trial where he was found liable of sexual assault following allegations first made back in 2018. So he's going to appeal this. So as we see, Connor, he wants to appeal this case. And Connor, you could actually appeal the case and you could possibly win. But what you could also do is you could become the president of the United States. Nigga, you're already halfway there. You're a billionaire, you're a Ray Piston, and you're white. But you have a secret weapon that even the most famous, grabbing by the meow, 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 president doesn't have. And that's, you are an MMA star. Do you know what that means, Connor? You're already halfway there, Connor. Here's the other half of the formula, okay? The first thing you gotta do is become a white supremacist. Problem yeah, boys. Shot. Stand back and stand by. Once you become a white supremacist, you got to say some stuff like, you know, Israel is bad and Netanyahu is bad and, you know, everything they do is bad and Zionism is bad and stuff. Once you start doing that, Piers Morgan's going to invite you to his channel. And then when Piers Morgan invites you to your channel, even before that, your YouTube and Dawa elites will spread your clips everywhere. Just trust me, trust me. I know what I'm talking about, okay? Your last play, when your your Tubi and Dawa at least start spreading your clips everywhere about Israel, Netanyahu, you know, genocide, bad, all that kind of stuff. Once they start doing that, your last play, your last play, is to say some sweet nothings about Islam. When the three Muslims split, that was the most traumatizing pop culture breakup since the Fat Boys. Fat boys. I'm telling you. If you start whisper, whispering sweet nothings about Islam and stuff, start saying, you know, how Islam is not so bad and it's good and, and masculine and all kind of stuff, they will come back together, all right? They're going to come back together. They will unite and they will start spreading your clips like wildfire. Trust me, I know what I'm talking about. Once you start doing all that kind of stuff, when your clips are going viral and violent stuff, you're going to start talking about how good Islam is. 
Y'all hearing me? Okay. St that's when you're going to start talking how good Islam is and how bad Zionism is, Zionism is and how, you know, you know, us white supremacists you should, you know, take a page out of the history of Muslims and stuff. And let me tell you, let me tell you something. YouTube and the elites, they ain't ever met a white supremacist, Ray Piston, MMA star. They ain't ever liked. Okay. They will be breaking out the baby oil Diddy style, homie, just to get an interview with you. Mahomedy Job is going to go on his channel talking about Conor McGregor. We would like to have a discussion with you about some of the things you said in the past about Islam. Three Muslims are going to come together. They are going to play every clip he ever said about it, good about Islam. No, I'm telling you. And that's when Eddie from the Dean Show is going to show up. When Eddie from the Dean Show show up, that's when you're going to do your interview with the YouTube dot elites, okay? All you got to do is bring that nigga a dime bag, okay? That's all you got to do. And I promise you, you can, you, you'll be able to turn this around in a hot minute. So I want you to imagine, Connor, okay? You don't have too many steps left to go, okay? You're already an MMA star. You're already a rape piston. All you got to do is become a white supremacist. And then start talking about Zionism and stuff, genocide and stuff. And then when you start speaking sweet nothings about Islam, forget it. Forget it. The twitching and twerking and twirling will be on full speed, full power. What's this? I got this message. One second, y'all. He hand washed those red panties so fast to twerk it up for Connor. What's this message say? One second. It's on my WhatsApp, y'all. Let me see what's going on. Let me pull this message up here. Connor McGregor. People want to hear from me. I needed time. I know I made mistakes. Six years ago, I should have never responded to her outreaches. I should have shut the party down. I should have never stepped out on the woman I love the most in the world. That's all on me. Eddie from the Dean Show. Come to Islam. What the fuck? Paper gold. You see, black folks are chumps. If America were to tell you to bring all the rocks in this country to her, and she'll give you a million dollars for it. You'll do it. And the next day she'll tell you we're using rocks for currencies, chump.